Welcome to FCTV with Aaron Racine following a playoff final defeat to Braintree Town. Aaron, how are you feeling off the back of the game? Obviously gutted. Obviously gutted for the result, for the players, for the fans. Just yeah, just to get so close and then to lose it probably in that manner. But we we're, were so close throughout the whole game. Was, um, yeah, it's gutted. I don't feel like there's any regrets that can be had today though. I feel like the team were a credit to themselves the way they performed. Do you think it was a really fine margin between who could have won and lost today? Yeah, I think, honestly, I, since I've said it like a hundred times now, but since Dean Buddy and I um, stepped in, they've honestly been a credit to the football club, to themselves and to us, just the way they, the way they've taken on the challenge um, of everything that's happened, the change in personnel, um, the bad form, the way they adapted and overcome that. It's, yeah, they've, they've been brilliant and it's generally more gutting or even more gutting just to not help them get over the line. Looking at this spell of time that you've, you've had in charge over this couple of months, how have you felt the team has come on? It felt like it's become your team over this time. Um, yeah, kind of. It's just I don't think we need to change too much you know, when we come in. Um, but it's almost a case of just keeping up the standards of you know what they've been doing all season and trying to um, stay on top of that. And I think you know I think we've done that. Obviously, a bit is hard at first with a few of the results we had, but you know towards the end of the year we um, picked up some good form and some good results. And, and, that, and again, that's credit to them. Just touch on the game a little bit about the performance and how the individuals played. Was there anyone who stood out for you today? No, I do. I don't. I don't really want to single out individuals. It's, in a game like today, it's just I know everyone was on, everyone was hungry for the same thing, and everyone worked as hard as they could for the same goal. Um, today is one of those days where it obviously just didn't go our way. The way they bounce back as well. Say again. The way they bounce back as well. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and we've done that a few times um, since you know Dean and I, Buddy and I have been in here. We've done, we've come back from uh, being a goal down, etc., and obviously drawing games. So again, that's a big thing that I spoke about in terms of like. Trying a bit of resilience when times get tough, and right, they've been doing it up until this day. I don't know today, so it's brilliant. Considering everything that's going to happen at the club in the summer, the new stands, the fact that we've got to this point to get to this final, how excited are you for what could happen next season? Yeah, look, I'm, you know, I'm here up until today. This is my time over at the club as, as it stands. So I'm excited um, as a fan's perspective. I'm excited to see what happens next year. Like you say, new stand, um, obviously new personnel coming in, whoever that may be. It's just a, uh, it's. It's an exciting time for the club.